President Mahama has taxed religious and traditional leaders to help reduce election violence. He pledged to accept results of the elections regardless of the outcome and urged other political actors to do the same. The President made this call at the palace of the paramount chief of Laura traditional area during his campaign tour in Laura. The 2016 elections covered like never before online, on air, and on mobile. This is your election command center. We are the specialists. President Mahama was at the palace to governize support ahead of the December polls. The paramount chief of Laura traditional area, Na Powele Kabo III, commended government for the pace of development across the country and advocated a peaceful campaign period. President Mahama condemned the use of intemperate language, which he said does not augur well for national unity. There cannot be one set of rules for one group and another set of rules for another. All of us were born equal in this country. And so I urge our civil society groups, our religious leaders, our traditional leaders, to keep an open and neutral position. So that if any of us is going wrong, you are the last recourse. If our traditional leaders and clergy jump into the, in the political fray, if things are going wrong, who is left? President Mahama later addressed a mini rally at Laura. Elections are about choices. It's about deciding between two things or three things or seven things. Which of the things is most precious to you and is in your best interest? And I believe, I believe that if we do that weighing as people of the Savannah, of the North, then NDC is more precious to us. Because under NDC governments, the North has seen more development than under any other government in the history of Ghana. At Jirapa, where he introduced the parliamentary candidate for the area, he urged the constituents to vote massively for the NDC and the candidate. Somebody says, when I come, I'll establish one something, one something, one something, one something. One village, one factory. One village, one dam. One constituency, one million dollars. But even if you are promising a constituency, we live in Ghana, we spend the city. Why say million dollars? We don't spend dollars in Ghana. So you should have even said four million Ghana cities, one constituency. He said one million dollars, uh, one constituency. He just shows your orientation is not correct. At Nadoli, supporters had to wait till about 10 p.m. to be addressed by the president. The president introduced the incumbent MP for the WA constituency and urged party supporters to vote for him. At Wala, he promised to construct more roads. Paramount chief of the Wala traditional area, Wana Fuseni Seydu Pelpo IV, commended the president for the infrastructural development in the area. <laughs> 